Hello, my name is Konstantin, this is project how to do and today I want to show you a very interesting and very simple wireless electricity transmission experiment. In fact, the simplest air transformer. I really like circuits like this, impressive and elementary in the repetition. So let's start. We need transistor 2N3904 or almost any similar NPN transistor. Any LED. Also we need Cooper winding wire 0.1-0.5 mm, about 15 meters. I use 0.13 mm or 36 American wire gauge, if you like. As always, list of all components with links in the description. You can find a suitable wire in almost any needless transformers. And that's it. It's all components we need for this project. First we need to make 3 coils, 30, 60 and 90 turns each. For a temporary frame, I used 1.5 inch PVC pipe. Place a piece of tape sticky side out, glue it one end of the wire and win 30 turns. Then fix the coil and pull it out from the frame. Leave about 10 cm wires for installation. Same with coils on 60 and 90 turns. In general you cannot worry about the frame and just wind coils on the fingers. I'm just trying to make it accurate. Now let's look at the circuit. It consists of two parts. Two coils and a transistor is a generator and the third coil and LED indicator. Getting to assembly. Clean winding wires, solder transistor legs, then you need to solder one end of 60 turns coil to the middle terminal of the transistor, to the base, if you are using 2N3904. If different, better search for datasheet. I also put a piece of hitching tube in Wainly, then you understand why. Solder the rest end of the coil to first transistor terminal, it's an emitter. Next step, solder any end of 30 turns coil to third transistor terminal, it's collector. Solder a little piece of regular wire to the first transistor leg, it's going to be power. Now turn off the LED and rest 90 turns coil. Simply solder the diodes terminals to the ends of the coil. The polarity is not important. At this assembly is completed. Device needed power supply of 1.5 to 9 volts. In my case it's two AA batteries in series. Place coils 1 and 2, one above the other. Plus is going to remind it end of 30 turns coil and wire with solder to first terminal to minus. Place the indicator coil nearby. Last step is touch transistor's base with something metal to start generator. Now you understand why heat shrink tube is vainly. And voila! LED lights, device works. If it doesn't, try to flip over one of the coil or change ends of 60 turns coil. That's it. Thanks for watching, share, subscribe and see you soon.